Sustainability Matters, in partnership with the University of Guam Center for Island Sustainability and Guam Green Growth, presented by Green Energy Solutions, Inc. Half a day, we're from the University of Guam Center for Island Sustainability, and we were formed in 2009 to lead and support the transition of our island region toward a sustainable future. And so one of the, uh, the big projects that we are facilitating right now is called the Guam Green Growth Initiative. And we're doing this in cooperation with the offices of the governor and the lieutenant governor of Guam. The Guam Green Growth Initiative is the island's most comprehensive public-private partnership ever created to achieve a sustainable future. According to Dr. Austin Shelton, director for the Center for Island Sustainability, there are three ways that the community can get involved with the G3 program. Here at the Chamorro Village, we are opening up the Guam Green Growth Circular Economy, Makerspace and Innovation Hub. And so what the circular economy uh, is, is that it's going to help our island address two big sustainability challenges. And that's one, the overproduction of waste, and number two, the over-reliance on imports. The second program that I wanted to mention is that we're going to be having the Guam Green Growth Conservation Corps coming out um, at the start of June. And it's gonna be a full-time, five-month project where we are going to be hiring um, 13 people for a workforce development training for the emerging green economy. And then the third way that the community can get involved is through our um, Guam Green Growth Commitment Program. We as an island consume so many foods, goods, and services that come via ships and airplanes. With the maker space located in the heart of Fagatnya at the Chamorro Village, we are able to keep materials in use and regenerate natural systems, creating a circular economy. Guam Green Growth Circular Economy Coordinator, Mariko Magol. The uh, Circular Economy Maker Space and Innovation Hub are ideal for those who are interested in the circular economy. So makers who are already practicing, uh, local entrepreneurs who are already in business, but also those who are just simply interested. You could be a craftsperson who just wants to figure out if they want to create something new from Guam and uh, start their own little business. The G3 Commitment Badge Program that is modeled after the United Nations 17 Sustainable Development Goals is also a way that community partners can get involved with. Guam Green Growth Project Coordinator Anania Nauta explains. It's open for businesses, uh, mayor's offices, uh, nonprofit organizations, and even community groups to um, apply for a badge. And these badges uh, pretty much just recognize the sustainable work that they're doing. We're proud to be facilitating this through the University of Guam uh, and the Center for Island Sustainability. And the three ways that you can get involved again coming up for you uh, in the next few months and uh, throughout the summer. It's all about local action for global impact. Sustainability Matters, in partnership with the University of Guam Center for Island Sustainability and Guam Green Growth, presented by Green Energy Solutions, Inc.